got an appointment for my client in Connecticut today. It was with the YMCA, and I met with the controller, or I talked with the controller. Um, recently stepped in the position, so he was just taking a, a look at everything as a whole, and uh, the, the managed service provider, their IT was something he wanted to look at. They have a, a few different vendors for a few different things, and he wants to consolidate that. Um, and everything that he mentioned they had covered is uh, service we offer, so it would be a great fit. So I uh, set up a meeting for them to talk and go more in depth about our capabilities. Um, they have about 75 users and then two locations, um, so it should be a pretty good one. All right, so I called this law firm last month. He told me it was pretty busy, couldn't schedule anything until this week. So I called him up today, asked him to schedule something with my IT client here in uh, Pennsylvania. And he was pretty open to just talking about how we can help him out. It's a 45 user company. They got two offices and a mixture of physical and cloud-based servers. So hopefully it goes well on Friday and we'll see where it goes. I was calling for my client in Toronto and uh, I emailed this guy like, a little over a month ago. Uh, he was interested uh, in learning more and he emailed me this morning and he was like, it's finally time to uh, sit down with your uh, CEO. So I set up the appointment for uh, today. Should be a pretty good one. Uh, so I got an appointment from my client today uh, for SEO, uh, roofer out in the Ohio area. Uh, wasn't really looking for SEO per se, uh, he just swamped the work, so we are going to be in talks with him about doing employee campaigns to bring in uh, extra employees for his business. I'm something for my guy down in San Antonio. It's with a non-profit, uh, it's an animal, I think it's a veterinarian clinic. Uh, it was kind of unique. I called the director of finance and uh, just called her direct extension. She picked up, told me she was walking out of the office, but IT is something they need to hit on before the end of the year. Uh, she said, can you send me an email and follow back up with me? I said, I can do one better. I'll send you an email, I'll have my owner follow up with you. What does next Tuesday at 2 look like? She said, that's perfect, have him give you a call. We need to do this anyways, uh, sooner rather than later. So it's gonna start with a phone call. I'm gonna talk to him here in a minute to see if uh, he had a chance to look at the email or the account yet. But yeah, I'll talk to him next week. Hopefully it'll be a really good one, especially because she was kind of uh, mentioning she needs to do something before the end of the year. Yeah, so I got one from my LA client. Um, it's with a nonprofit museum. Uh, the IT guy manages about 100 users. Um, he uses a lot of companies like us for project work. Um, he's not tied into any contract and had some things that he was specifically looking for. Uh, you know, kind of top of mind coming up. So I connected him with my owner just to see if we can be uh, a good, a valuable asset to his back pocket for supplemental support and being a backup. Um, it looked like they were. Um, going back and forth, sending information about what they have after the meeting. So uh, it looked like it went pretty well and just kind of trying to figure out next steps. Okay, so I set up uh, an appointment with a real estate development company. They also are like an engineering firm. Um, and so the COO there was super open to meeting. He said he didn't have a good local resource. Uh, for IT services, and he's, he's, he'd called quite a few to help over the past few years and just hadn't gotten good service, so he was really happy that we called. Um, it wasn't too big, so I was like, you know, not sure if it was worth sending someone out there. But um, at the end of the call, he had mentioned that he's starting a partnership with a, a very large Fortune 500 company um, that would put that firm in control of all their development of new commercial properties. So that would be a really good strategic alliance to have moving forward and I think could make a big impact on my, my client's business.